Are you tired of those pesky, enlarged pores staring back at you? You've probably heard the old trick. Splash your face with cold water to shrink those pores right down. But does it really work? Well, I'm here today to reveal the truth about pore size, debunk some myths, and give you real, actionable solutions for smoother, tighter, looking skin. Let's dive in. First things first, let's get a little geeky. Pores aren't just holes in your skin. They're openings of hair follicles with tiny oil glands attached. These glands produce sebum, your skin's natural oil. Pores are totally essential for keeping your skin healthy and moisturized. So why do some people have more noticeable pores? Well, blame it on a few things. Genetics. Sorry, folks. Sometimes it's in your DNA. Oily skin. If you have an oilier skin type, your pores tend to be larger to handle that oil flow. Age. As we age, skin loses collagen and elasticity, making pores appear stretched. Sun damage. Too much sun weakens skin support, again making pores look bigger. Now, about that cold water trick. Yes, cold water can temporarily constrict blood vessels right below the skin's surface. This might make pores seem smaller for a short while. But here's the catch. It doesn't change the actual size of your pores. Think of it like a temporary tightening effect that fades as your skin warms back up. Wait, don't throw out the ice cubes just yet. Cold water does have its perks. Refreshed feeling. That cool blast feels amazing, especially on a hot day. Reduced puffiness. It can temporarily depuff your face, especially around the eyes. Soothed inflammation. If you have irritated skin, cool water can feel calming. Okay, let's get down to the good stuff. While you can't magically shrink your pores away, there are ways to minimize their appearance and get super smooth looking skin. Cleanse. Washing your face twice a day with a gentle cleanser gets rid of oil, dirt, and makeup that can clog and stretch your pores. Exfoliate regularly. Those dead skin cells have a nasty habit of clogging pores. Use a chemical exfoliator with ahas or bez a few times a week to unclog and refine. The power of retinoids. The gold standard. Retinol boosts collagen, thickens skin, and keeps pores clear, minimizing their appearance over time. Start with an over, the counter retinol, and work your way up. Clay mask magic. These masks are oil magnets. Treat yourself to one weekly to soak up excess sebum and give your pores a deep clean. Choose smart makeup. Look for non-comedogenics makeup. This means it's formulated not to clog pores. A few extra things to keep in mind. Sun protection is key. Never skip the spath. Sun damage makes pores look even worse. Hydrate, hydrate. Even oily skin needs moisture. Choose a lightweight, oil-free moisturizer. Don't pick or squeeze. It leads to inflammation and can make pores appear larger. Why avoid making your pores worse? Stop these habits. Aggressive scrubbing. Overly harsh scrubs irritate skin and can actually cause inflammation around your pores. Gentle is the way to go. Endless steaming. While the occasional steam can soften up gunk in your pores, going overboard weakens skin elasticity, dye pore strips. Tempting, but these mainly pull out hair and irritate skin, and the effect is minimal and short-lived. If you're super concerned about your pores or your at-home routine isn't doing the trick, it's time to consult a dermatologist. They can recommend prescription strength retinoids. These guys are serious pore minimizers. Professional peels. For a deeper clean and pore reset, lasers and microneedling. These treatments stimulate collagen and can make a big difference over time. All right, guys. I want to hear from you. Have you ever tried the cold water trick? Did it work for you? What's your favorite way to take care of your pores? Share your secret weapons. Any pressing questions about pores? Ask away 
and I'll answer them in the comments. Remember, while we can't erase our pores for good, the right routine will make a big difference. Be consistent, be patient, and focus on overall healthy skin. And before you know it, those pores won't be stealing the spotlight anymore. Thanks for watching. If you found this helpful, please hit those like and subscribe buttons. It really supports the channel and lets me know to create more skin-loving content for you.